This is my second walk around parts of Chippenham not visited before. Here is a walking map showing the route taken. I started from the town bridge and firstly admired a family of swans enjoying themselves. Looking at busy new road, we can see the railway viaduct in the distance. This was built by Brunel for the railway in 1841. What interesting upper stories there are on these shops. I wonder what the history of this one is on the corner of New Road and Fogmanshire. I turned right into Moncton Hill, where the Central Methodist Church can be seen. This was built in 1909. To reach the river, I turned right into Avon Reach, along past the car park, and was soon on the river walk. Passing in front of the council offices, there is an intriguing statue which I understand is called the Twister. Originally, there were drawings by children in the design. To some, it might have appeared to have been vandalised, but not so. Sadly, these have faded over time. See the old photograph. Continuing along the path, the children's play area can be seen in the distance. I then came to an attractive bridge over the River Avon. Crossing over, I turned left and followed the path. going over a small stream which is silted up with leaves. I thought this was a lovely view through the trees to the other side of the river. Now climb up the slope into St Mary Street. You may hear the sound of children playing in the nursery school on the left. Turn left into St Mary Street and let us see where it leads. This school was built, as you can see, in 1837. 
and now forms part of King Alfred Hall, which can be reached by climbing these steps into the churchyard of St Andrew's Church. These steps are very interesting, but cannot be clearly seen in this clip, so a cartoon figure has been added. Walking along the path at the eastern end of the church, we pass several box tombs. There is an interesting view of the large houses in St Mary Street. The old vicarage on the left is now a nursing home. Next to it is Zeely's house, named after the surgeon it was built for. The wood house is a former burgher's house, dating from 1544, and is perhaps the oldest building in Chippenham still in residential occupation. Continue round to the front of the church, where you are at the other end of the rank of buildings, with King Alfred Hall at the further end. I'm now out in the marketplace, where we can see the Yield Hall and War Memorial. A building of note is the Jubilee Building, now used by the Chippenham Borough Lands Charity. It was first used as a library and scientific institute. This historic old pub, the Rose and Crown, is dating from 1390. Part has now been turned into a Thai restaurant, through Lord's Lane to the bus station and the bus back to Calm.